morning, everybody. Welcome to Storytime. I'm Miss Kirsten. We're going to sing Let's Get Ready for Storytime. So can you tap along and do what I do? Here we go. Ready? We're all here for Storytime, Storytime, Storytime. We're all here for Storytime. Let's get started now. Can you turn your ears up high, ears up high, ears up high? Can you turn your ears up high so that you can hear? Can you open your eyes up wide, eyes up wide, eyes up wide? Can you open your eyes up wide so that you can see? Now we're ready for story time, story time, story time. Now we're ready for story time. Let's get started now. Good job, you guys. All right, we're going to sing the wheels on the bus. Can you get your wheels ready? The wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go round and round all through the town. The wipers on the bus go swish, 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 swish. Swish, 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 the wipers on the bus go swish, 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 all through the town. The horn on the bus goes beep, 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 beep. The horn on the bus goes beep, 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 all through the town. The doors on the bus go open and shut, open and shut, open and shut. The doors on the bus go open and shut, all through the town. The driver on the bus says move on back, move on back, move on back. The driver on the bus says, move on back, all through the town. The kids on the bus go up and down, up and down, up and down. The kids on the bus go up and down, all through the town. The babies on the bus go wah, 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 wah. The babies on the bus go wah, 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 all through the town. The mummies on the bus go shh, 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 all through the town. The daddies on the bus go, I love you, I love you, I love you. The daddies on the bus go, I love you, all through the town. Good job, everybody. Yay! Good job. Okay. What are we going to read about today? It's on the cover of this book. That's right, it's a cat. So our story today is called No Fuzzball by Isabella Kong, and we're gonna thank Scholastic for allowing us to read this book in story time today. No, Fuzzball! Here we go. Hello, I am Fuzzball. Perhaps you've never heard a name like this before, but that is because you have not met me, a queen like me. My subjects worship me. Hear how they scream my name everywhere I go. No, Fuzzball! Uh-oh. We live in my kingdom in total harmony. See how my subjects do all my bidding. They entertain me, feed me, groom me, massage me, and shower me with presents. Oh, look! A new gift! What a perfect queen-size bed! No fuzzball! Ugh, sometimes they can be a little too clingy. They messed up my royal coat. A queen cannot tolerate such disrespect. I demand a formal apology. Wait, they left. How dare they forget their place? What has got into them? Ah, oh, yes, of course. My subjects must be so ashamed of their behavior. They went to find the perfect royal offering for me. Glad they took that disgusting, slobbering mess, too. Finally, some peace and quiet. Time for... Some uninterrupted, oh, beauty sleep. Can you just take a nap? That nap was divine. Now, where is that personal massage of mine? She knows I must have my daily massages. Hello! I'm awake now! They are still gone. Where did they go? They have never been gone away this long. They are not that smart.
heart. What if they're lost or hurt? Maybe someone captured them. What if? Where do you think they went? They just don't want to live in my kingdom anymore. Oh no, how does she look? Looks like she's sad, huh? I know, I will be a charitable ruler. I will make them the finest beds, share my fanciest toys, spoil them with my greatest gifts. Nothing is too good for my subjects. They are family. I'll need to redecorate the palace too. I must redesign the racetrack, carve out the best napping areas, and freshen things up with my signature style. Oh, look what she's doing to the house. I think they're gonna like that. They are going to love my royal renovations. Ruff, ruff, oh, what is that noise? My subjects, have they returned home? What did they call me? Has it been so long? They have forgotten their queen's name is? You guys remember what her name is? Can you stay with me when I turn the page? Ready, here we go. No, Fuzzball! Oh, they love me. I hope you guys enjoyed that story. All right, I'm gonna use my dog friend here. And now we're gonna do head, shoulders, knees, and toes. So we'll do Sit up. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, and then eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Okay, so let's get warmed up. Can you put your hands on your head? All right, are you guys ready? Here we go. Ready? Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes, knees, and toes. Good job, you guys. All right, can you do it a little bit faster? What do you think? I think you can. Ready? Can you put your hands on your head? Here we go. We're gonna go faster. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Good job, you guys. Do you think you can do it even faster? All right, here we go. Put your hands on your head. Are you ready for super fast? Ready? Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Good job, you guys, good job. All right, so now we're gonna cool down and we're gonna do it super slow. Are you ready? Here we go. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Eyes and ears and mouth and nose. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Good job, you guys, yay, good job. Put my dog back up here. Okay, we're gonna read our next story. All right, so I'm gonna cover our next story. That's right, it's a cat. What color is the cat? Blue. So this one is called Blue Cat by Charlie E. Bryan. And we're gonna thank Boyd Mills and Kane for allowing us to read this book today in story time. Blue Cat. Blue cat lounges. Blue cat stretches. Can you stretch at home? Good job, my friends. Blue cat swats. Blue cat jumps, splashes, almost crashes. What's the cat trying to get? Goldfish, huh, in the bowl. He's gonna get him. Blue cat purrs. Can you purr like a cat? Purr. Good job. Blue cat listens. What do we listen with? Our ears. Can you point your ears? Good job. Blue cat peeks. Blue cat sneaks. Where's he going? Do you see a cat? Sammy's right there, look. Blue cat creeps. Blue cat pounces. What does pounce mean? That's right, it means jump. 
jump. Roar! Meow! Who's this? What color is this? Red, good job my friends. Blue cat snuggles, mama cat cuddles. Like that cat book. All right, now we're gonna do our felt board. We're gonna do five little speckled frogs. Can you guys count to five with me? Let's count right here. Look, there's some members here to count. One, two, three, four, five, right? What is this? A log. So let's see, can you want me count my five frogs out there? Ready, here we go. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, so what we're gonna do is you're gonna take your arm and you're gonna put it across like this and it's gonna be your log. And how many frogs do we have? Five, so you can show me five fingers. Good job, my friends. And we're gonna put five little speckled frogs sitting on a speckled log and they're gonna eat the most delicious bugs. Then you're gonna cut, cut your tummy like this and go yum, yum. And one's gonna jump into the pool where it was nice and cool, so you gotta shiver because it's cold. And now there are, and we'll count down. All right, are you guys ready? Can you sing along with me and do the movements? How many frogs do we have on our log? Five. Five little speckled frogs sitting on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cold. Now there are four speckled frogs. Four little speckled frogs sitting on a speckled log eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are three speckled frogs. Three little speckled frogs sitting on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are two speckled frogs. Two little speckled frogs sitting on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there is one speckled frog, one little speckled frog sitting on a speckled log, eating the most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. He jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are no speckled frogs. How many are left? Zero. Good job, you guys. All right, we're going to end story time today by singing Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Star. Can you get your stars out and sing along with me? Ready? Here we go. Twinkle. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Good job, you guys. Yay! Good job. Well, thank you for joining me for Family Storytime today, and have a wonderful